Did you ever have something really cool on your iPhone or iPad that you wanted to see on your computer screen? Maybe you want to play a game, watch a video or photo show, demo a cool new app for someone, or share a presentation. Well, you can, and it's really easy. Hi, this is Chris Massiello from VitaminCM.com, and today I'm going to show you how to display everything happening on your iPhone or iPad on your computer's screen in real time. If you have an Apple TV, you may have used AirPlay to share pictures or movies or music with your TV. Well, an app called Reflector allows you to do the same thing with your Mac or Windows computer. Start by going to their website and buying the software. It's $12.99. It's airsquirrels.com. Click the link in the show notes for full details and instructions. Once you have the software installed and running, you're ready to go. You don't need to install anything on your iOS device because AirPlay mirroring is built right into the operating system. Connect your iOS device to your Wi-Fi network, then swipe up from the bottom and you'll see the AirPlay icon on your control center. Now you'll see your iPhone and you'll see the name that you gave the reflector server. So I'll click on that and then there'll be an option called mirroring. You want to slide the little button over to the right and your phone will appear on your screen. When you hit done, you'll see your phone's home screen. So now anything you do on your phone you'll be able to see on your computer. If I open an application like Twitter for instance, you'll see whatever I'm doing on my screen in real time. So if I scroll up and down you can see it scrolls in real time. If I open up my photos you'll be able to see my photos. It makes the photos go full screen. If I open up an application that has landscape mode, as soon as I turn my phone on its side, you'll notice the preview turns on its side and you can scroll through. If I flip it back up to portrait, it flips right back up for me. Let's say I wanted to open up a slide presentation. I can flick through a slide presentation. Now if you're doing something like a slide presentation, you might want to show it in full screen mode. So if I go to device, enter full screen, you'll see my device go full screen. The other thing you can do is you can put a different frame around it. So I have it as an iOS black phone. If I switch it to a white one, you'll see it switches or you can just take the frame off altogether and you'll just see what's on the screen. You can also record. So I'm recording with a different piece of software now so you can see my whole Mac desktop. But if I wanted, I could switch and use the recording that's built into the application. So these are some of the really cool things that you can do with Reflector. Take a look at the link in the show notes and you can see where to download this and some other information.